This episode of Fleet Equipments on the Road is brought to you by Gabriel. Visit www.gabriel.com for more information and enjoy the show. So, hey Jason, are you sure you know where you're going? I think Dean's right. I don't recognize this at all. Nah, don't worry about it. This is a shortcut. Recently, Daimler Trucks announced an investment to enable production of the new DD5 and DD8 medium-duty engines at the Detroit brand headquarters and manufacturing facility in Redford, Michigan. The OE also celebrated the start of production of its DT12 AMT at that same plant. I grabbed a cup of coffee with Dr. Frank Reingest, global head of powertrain for Daimler Trucks, to talk about the new engine, growing the supply line, and manufacturing in a global world. But first, a word from Dr. Wolfgang Bernhard, Daimler AG Board of Management member responsible for trucks and buses. And to bring the new medium duty engine line to the US, we invest another $375 million and create another 160 qualified, highly qualified jobs. Daimler was tight lipped about the medium duty DD5 and DD8 performance specs before its spring 2016 launch, but Dr. Ryan just did share some insight. Um, fuel consumption, which is a question of optimizing the the inner the internal combustion map, mm-hmm. very very good. Yeah, you've heard that we <laughs> that we won't that we won't communicate the figures we've right. seen, but it's right. it's tremendous. Right. Yeah. That will be a game changer. Yeah. Growing the DT12's production capacity was another big talking point. And production in Redford makes good on the commitment made during President Obama's visit to the Redford facility in December of 2012, while shortening fleet's wait for the AMT. D212 and the engines were very popular, and we know that yeah, there was yeah. a very long backlog. Yeah, 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 uh, yeah. Is this going to speed up the, yes, the take obviously. time there? Yeah, we, you see, we are installing here 40, 50,000 unit capacity mm-hmm. for the DT12. This simply adds up to the available network capacity. So that's a huge, um, huge increasement. The new Detroit DD5 and DD8 engine development is another example of Daimler's international development effort, with global testing and validation being undertaken in both Europe and the United States. Doing it around the world uh, enables us to learn from each other and, and just take field quality. Yeah? If one, wherever in the world, launches the product, and the others, will, which will then follow later, will, will obviously um, take advantage out of these learnings. Mm-hmm. Keep it tuned to www.fleetequipmentmag.com for even more episodes of On the Road and the latest in heavy-duty news and feature stories.